Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, one thing that was broken with the October Patch Tuesday updates was the Windows Recovery Environment, where the USB was kind of disabled, so mice and keyboards couldn't work. So the Windows Recovery Environment, of course, uses a minimal um, startup of Windows to enable you to, of course get into maybe a recovery, a reinstall of Windows, and so on. But it was completely useless because your mouse and keyboard wouldn't work. Now, today, the 20th on Monday, it is fixed. So that is fixed. Uh, as they do say that now it is resolved, USB, mouse, and keyboard not working. And uh, that was, of course, uh, starting last week with the 14th of October Patch Tuesday updates. So now it's resolved. There's no more issue with that. So this was on uh, Windows 11 24H2. Was it a problem on Windows 10? Just out of curiosity. Uh, known issues for Windows uh, 10. Let's check it out here. Known issues. I wonder if that was a problem there too. And no, there was no problem with that there. So uh, it's really Windows 11 only that had that issue with the recovery environment. Uh, probably on 25H2 also, I would guess. So let's check it out. Yeah, 25H2 also was affected by the recovery environment problem. So uh, it is now fixed starting today. So uh, that's good news as they were quick to fix that, which was very important anyways, because if you had to end up in the recovery environment and not have a mouse or a keyboard, you are kind of stuck, couldn't do anything. So uh, glad to see that it is now fixed uh, today. That was a quick one. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.